Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to calculate Carnot engine efficiency when the temperature is given. To calculate the Carnot engine efficiency, we need two temperatures. We need the temperature of the two reservoirs in the system. So we have a cold reservoir, which we're going to denote the temperature for that reservoir as T sub C, and we have a hot reservoir. So the temperature for that reservoir is going to be T sub H. Now the Carnot efficiency is associated with the maximum amount of work that can be done due to the differences in these temperatures for your engine. So we're going to denote the efficiency with the Greek letter eta, and it's defined as the temperature of the hot reservoir minus that of the cold divided by that of the hot. And we can multiply by 100%, such that eta will be bound by 0 and 100%. So as a simple example, we can consider the temperature of the cold reservoir as 300 degrees Kelvin. So it's important to note that when calculating the Carnot efficiency, we use the unit of Kelvin for temperature. And the temperature for the hot reservoir, let's say, is 400 Kelvin. Respectively, these correspond to approximately 27 degrees Celsius and 127 degrees Celsius. They're both linear scales, so the difference in the temperature is 100 degrees here. So if we plug these numbers into our expression for the efficiency, we see that we can simplify this to 1 minus the ratio of the temperature of the cold reservoir to that of the hot and multiply by 100%. And when we use these numbers, we end up with an efficiency of 25%. So this is how you would calculate the efficiency given the temperatures. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to calculate Carnot efficiency of your engine when the temperature is given. Mm -hmm.